Oh, the joy of this job, when I see the students and teachers eating my food with a great smile, that makes my day. Hello, good morning. I'm Madam Aini of BT Secondary School. I'm a canteen operator. I've been doing this for 21 years. Oh, typical day is like, wake up in the morning as per normal, like, yeah? left the house earlier, reach school by 4.15. And then prepare everything, start cooking by 5. And then later, my assistant will come and help me with the other dishes. Whereas I cook all the main dish. My first customer will come in at as early as 6.30. And as always, the teachers and some students. When I started this business, from day one, I always tell myself, I do this is for the children. How I treat the children like my own children, and then when they want to eat, I make sure they have enough. And then those who have enough, I help them. And then I make sure they have a feeling stomach for them to go to school. At least when I go back, I know they have one complete meal from school. I can sense a uh, student whether they got enough food and enough money or not. By looking at them, they just wander around, but they don't want to eat. And then I ask them, you want to eat? No, I don't want to eat. And some of the friends say, auntie, she got no money. Uh, then I call them over, I just give him. I don't think of whether I'm making business or not. What most important to me is that make sure these children, they have enough food to eat and fill their stomach and that makes them study well. Because if they go with hungry stomach, they can't study. Summer boring too, huh? Summer boring, huh? When they behave badly, especially using the vulgar words or that, from day one when I started in Mansu, I'm very fierce with students. I would tell them, never, never use these words. One more time, you use this word, oh, chubu. No, auntie, I cannot wait. I, I can't get your meal because finish. I say, I don't care. Until you change yourself, don't use bubble word, I'll let you eat. If not, go behind. And then they, they study from there and they turn to a good boy. Because when we're doing this, we're teaching the student to be well-mannered. And also, don't use words that you're not supposed to use. I like your tudo. Oh, I have my cousin for more than 10 years who's helping me. She's responsible for all the vegetables, dishes. Once I finish my main dishes, she take over the stove. She lighten my burden a bit. Got someone to take over, I can sit down for a while. Yeah, that affects my legs very much because if I stand too much or so, I will get cramps and also my nerves start pulling. When I think of the students, I always think of my children. They have they enough food? That makes me want to continue again, you see? Until the school said, I don't need you, then too bad. <laughs> but as long as I can go, I will go. Have you too? Like that, la. <laughs> like that. Oh, like that, like that. Okay. Oh my God.